Because my sister was the oldest and I was the youngest of four children, we never got to know each other very well when we were young. But as they say, it's not how you begin, but how you end that counts. In the past 15 years, we talked almost every day on the phone and got to know each other as sisters. We learned we had a lot of things in common. Things like loving music, appreciating the beauty of nature, and most importantly, our love for Christ. We talked about the struggles we had through the years, the need to forgive others, and the answers to life's problems that are found in the scriptures. Other than Jesus, she loved her two children more than anything on the earth. And she prized her friends so dearly. If you're watching this, you are probably one of those friends. I know she had many. I would like to thank you for being her friend because like Esther, I also prize friendship. Now, I'm not sad for my sister. In fact, I'm a little jealous that she's with the Lord and I'm still stuck down here. I know for her, it will be but a moment and I'll be going home and see her again. I look forward to worshiping our Lord and Savior with her. In her last few weeks on earth, I shared with her the following song. It gave her comfort, and I think she would want you to be blessed by it today. Think of it as her parting gift to you, and to God be all the glory. Oh,